Hey, what up, everybody? This is Stevie Breach coming to you. I hope everybody chilled out and watched their good San Francisco 49ers play. I chilled out and watched it with my Arizona raspberry iced tea. Very, very fun stuff. 33-14. Honestly, I think that game was a little bit closer than what the final score is going to be. Of course, everybody had to uh, have seen the uh, big Kendall Hunter play on special teams to end out the game. Felt very, very sorry um, for the uh, Tampa Bay Buccaneers player out there running the reverse out there. But once you uh, saw him come off the field, it didn't look like it was a played call by the coach. Coach didn't look like he knew anything about it. He didn't let the guy go back out there or turn the next kick. Seeing that he was going out there to try and play off a, a little bit of magic, and it didn't work out for him. I honestly don't even know if they would have pulled off the reverse, if it really would have helped him out all that much. Uh, it, it looked like the 49ers were already... Uh, uh, going to be able to get back into coverage and maybe they would have got one yard maybe even got two yards but there was even a good chance that the guy was going to get a loss of yardage uh, and not be able to turn the corner on but hey you never know with football I've never been a big fan of the reverse myself Niners get the big win uh, they never trail uh, the closest the Buccaneers were was the kickoff when it was zero to zero and um we never really pulled ahead until the very end that I really, really wanted to, but it was one of those games that I knew that once we had the first touchdown on the board, as long as we were ahead, I knew we'd be able to cruise on through. I never really felt like we were in uh, any you know sudden danger or anything like that. I just would have felt that it, it would be a little bit more comfortable to put a few more uh, points up on the board. This is one of those, ga those games where you're just uh, you're going through the motions. Uh, you're just getting used to the guys that are around you. Kaepernick finally seems like he's comfortable back there again and it sucks for me to say that about my own team's quarterback but um I, I don't know the, the the beginning part of this season he never really seemed to you know be in his groove he got to run the ball four times got 40 yards on the run he threw the big bomb to Vernon Davis who caught a ball a touchdown pass by Michael uh Crabtree as well he threw for over 200 yards two touchdowns uh those are the kind of stats you want to see Frank Gore uh, I guess past the milestone of going over a thousand yards for the uh, seventh, seventh time in his career. Has he been in the league that long? Good God, you take Frank Gore for granted as a guy who uh, is going to be back there forever and ever, and already seven years over the age of thirty. And um, yeah, you will have to see uh, how many more years this can continue. Uh, I, I loved Dixon in the backfield. I, I love having uh, Hunter back there. Um, of course, everybody knows about um, our new uh, youngster running special teams for us who names, uh, fuck me, I forgot his name. But um, <coughs> people think he's going to be the wave of the future. I think he'd be getting the ball a little bit more in the backfield if he, if he really was. But uh, the Michael James is uh, one guy that I think some people have their finger on to move forward. You know, um, from here on out, it looks like we're not going to get any help out there with the getting the Seahawks loss or a Saints loss. But... Um, We'll see what we can do. Uh, the, the Seahawks won 23 to zero today. It was it, it was gonna take nothing more than a uh, a miracle if, um, if for us to even to get into a home field advantage sort of a playoff picture there for you. But uh, you know this is what we uh, did. We dug this own hole for ourselves, and we're gonna have to try and dig our way out. So uh, for me, this is Stevie Breach saying on to uh, the next week of uh, San Francisco 49er football, and. Um, it is what it is. Peace out.